Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a fantastic day. I have a bit of a Born Pretty haul that arrived a week or so ago and I'm going to show you some of the products today. So what I have here is one stamping plate. I have their humongous stamper, which I'll show you in a sec. One of their little tiny scrapers. It's actually got really cute little snowflakes on it, so I'm excited to use that. And then their... I'm not exactly sure of the name, but I'll put it below. And then a stamper, another stamper, which is a clear head, which as you can see is super magnifying. So we're gonna use that one today as well. So both stampers. So I'll get all that out the way and I'm gonna show you the plate that I'm gonna to review today. So that is the name of it. I'm not even, not even gonna begin to pronounce that because I'll say it wrong. So it comes in these pretty little cases. And as you can see, it is all things to do with the sea. So cute little shell patterns and bubbles. And then there's some sort of little sailors across here and some sort of nautical themed stuff. So I am not gonna talk anymore. I'm going to use my Nail Stamping Queen white polish to stamp with. I have probably overdone it with the color pops. I think there's 10 blue ones there. I'm going to do a little bit with the bigger stamper just to see what I think of it and then I'm gonna do the rest with the smaller stamper. So gonna get straight into it. I'm just gonna zoom in, show you the plate quickly one more time and I'll come back at the end. Okay, just before I start, I did actually forget to show you the humongous stamper. So this is it, this is upside down and it has got a wrapper on. I just wanted to tell you the measurements. So it's 11.5 centimeters long by 4.5 centimeters wide. It obviously has the Born Pretty logo. So this is the stamper side. So it comes with a protective wrapping. So I am just gonna take this off to show you. So it just peels off really easily. And it's reasonably sticky. So you can take that out. And it's, <laughs> it's kind of creepy to hold actually. Okay, we'll put that back in. So that's what the stamper's like. I'm going to just run a lint roller over it quickly and then I'm gonna get straight on with the stamping. I'm only gonna do one swatch with this because this is gonna take up an enormous amount of polish and I don't have that much white left. So let's get to it. Okay, all done and top coated. Right, I'm just gonna run through the products quickly. Love the scraper. I did only use it for the last few nails because I forgot to change over. I used a larger scraper to stamp when I wanted to use the bigger stamper. But I do like the scraper. I think that's super cute. Love this stamper. I think this is really nice. It's got a nice big medium squishy non-sticky head that is magnifying. 
So love that, the plate is super cute. Now I must say the jewelry is definitely out on the large stamper. I didn't get on with it at all. I'm very fussy with the stampers that I do use. I was finding, I did a lot of this off camera and I was finding that the actual, this was coming out the holder really, really easily. I was also using a polish that I'm not particularly familiar with and I don't think it got on with this stamper at all. It was literally just peeling off. And I also found that I couldn't stamp quickly enough before the polish dried. So I'm going to play around with that. If I have any more luck, I will let you know. But for me personally, I probably wouldn't use that again, but I will just do a bit more research for the sake of the video. Don't mind me. I just wanted to show you the images. So they're all super cute, but these two end ones were the ones that I did with the large stamper. I wasn't even going to bother including this one because it's so bad, but I just thought I'd show you what I did. Love the plate. As I said, super cute. So I will report back if I have any more luck with the stamper. I'm going to leave it there guys, so thumbs up if you like the video, if you've got any comments or questions for me, pop them in the comments box. I will link my 10% discount code on the screen now, which is Mrs. DW10, that will give you 10% off your order from Born Pretty. Also, all of my discount codes are always in the description bar under the video. I think that's it, please subscribe if you haven't already guys, I will have the rest of this Born Pretty haul to show you very soon and I've got another one on the way, so I will show you that too. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye.